rushing for one, threw for 292 yards in the game. Dangerous on the ground and through the air, but the Irish there to meet Derek Green for a game. Punches his first catch is good for 12 yards and a Michigan first down. And going the other way here is Northleaf, just five feet seven. Tough to see coming around those blockers, and he's a He's the dominion of one. Michigan on the move with another first down. They go to Funches, and Funches gets no more than a yard and a half. A.J. McCarron. Gardner just kind of improvising and just dumps it off to Northleaf, who's crushed. So here are the Wolverines trailing 7-0. And this is our first look at Davion Smith, his two-pronged attack for Michigan. We told you about Derek. Second and five, they give it to Smith again, and Smith the first down yardage. Finally tripped up. Well, it was 102nd in the nation in rushing last year. One of the big areas that they want to improve on, and Funchess is in the clear. 6-5, 230, up Notre Dame. Michigan sets up deep in its own territory. You'll see a lot of this. Gardner rolling out. And this, like Denard Robinson was hurt. Multi-talented, dangerous on the ground and through the air. And here is Gardner to the near side. That one is complete for the first of 14 last week in the win against Appalachian State. Begins this drive with a handoff to Norfleet. And Norfleet with a good gain. Gardner time and is knocked down out of his hands. And he's lucky to just get it back. But the ball all the way back. Up the middle, 6'5", 315 pounds, pressuring back into Gardner. See, Gardner's bringing it down back to his body, and I thought Jerron Jones slapped it away. And if he slaps it away and gets a piece, then it is indeed a fumble. After further review, the ruling on the field of a fumble recovered by the quarterback is confirmed. I think that's kidded quarterback. Anything's possible. If Devin Gardner can do here in the waning seconds, incomplete one at fun offensive snaps in the first half. There's a hole. Gardner down the middle of the field, incomplete. Six and eight on the road, and he's in a 21 zip hole. Gardner wheeling out to his right, being chased by Isaac Rochelle, and Gardner is able to out in the first half. And picking up the first down is Derek Green. Ball at the 36. Gardner hanging in the pocket, steps up. The pressure gets to him, but he gets away from it and gets across the 40, still short of the first down, but Gardner turning stink after the beautiful punt pins him there by Brinza. Green tries to buy him a little breathing room and since 0 for 6 with a pick. Second and 7. And not much there again 49 yards in all and Michigan it's got more than a little breathing room now as Davion Smith gets the call that was the first so Devin Gardner beginning at his own 16 goes to the air and it's complete to fun so far except for one interception by Michigan this is green And they haven't been able to run the football. Last week against Appalachia. This is 5-9. Yeah, but there's a safety over top. Second and nine. Gardner's looking for this way. Now he's scrambling. And fumbles the football, and I believe Notre Dame has it. Yes, they do. Last thing Michigan needs now is this turnover. Joe Schmidt. The former walk-on middle linebacker is going to get a piece. Gardner keeps it alive, eyes down the field. Number 38 from the left side, right there with the hit. Ball pops loose. Number 90, Isaac Rochelle jumps on top, and it's big turnover for Notre Dame. Schmidt, the former walk-on who earned himself a starting job. Double thumbs up. Four possessions, three turnovers, and a punt. That's not going to get you out of a 21-0 hole at halftime, which they were down. 18 turnovers for Michigan. The pass complete to Khalid Hill. 
Gardner feels pressure from the left, tries to get out of it, but he is not going to get away from Jerron Jones, who wrapped him up low. It was the edge pressure from Matthias Farley coming this way that forces the step up into the pocket. Once he gets forced up, then Jerron Jones, who's had a big night tonight, finishes the play. Jones is a man. He, he, he's a dude, and there's a difference between a guy and a dude. And maybe a yard for Davion Smith. Romeo Aguara up there had a sack last week versus Rice. Mm. Chargers pass complete. How well they've tackled and how aggressive and fast they've played defensively. 